as we all know, earlier this week, we officially received the Iron Man update. Boy, oh boy, was it massive. Tony Stark arrived on the island as an NPC, and with him, he brought some absolutely insane Iron Man armories that drop in from the sky each and every single game. In addition to that, we all know that the Iron Man Mark 45 skin arrived in the item shop. However, everyone's been kind of disappointed because out of all the cosmetics, there's not a single emote. The reason for that is Epic Games is actually giving a free Iron Man emote to everyone. But first, if you don't hit the thumbs up button on this video, exactly 111 days whenever you log on to Fortnite, this will happen. No! If you do hit the thumbs up button on this video, exactly 111 days when you log on to Fortnite, this will be waiting for you. Choice is all yours, so choose carefully. If you want to go the extra mile to support the channel, just head on over to the item shop and input my code HOMAGAMESYT. But ladies and gentlemen, we wasted too much time. We have a ton of awesome stuff to cover right here in this video, including a free Iron Man emote everyone can unlock. Let's get into it. Now, super quickly, before we unlock the free Iron Man emo, first things first, we all know that in the brand new update, we brought in a couple of brand new Iron Man mythics. One of them being Iron Man's combat kit, the other being Iron Man's flight kit. Well, did you know that with the Iron Man's flight kit specifically, this thing actually is one of the craziest glitches I've seen in a very long time. Now, I'm gonna show you how to do it right now. First things first, as soon as you jump out of the battle bus, you're gonna wanna begin making your way to the restored reels point of interest. Now, what we're looking for here is actually one of the new Avengers chests. Restored reels is the best point of interest to find them as a total of five of them can spawn here once you land here just start searching as many chests as possible and what we're looking for is actually the war machines hover jets hey and there we go ladies and gentlemen it took a little bit but we finally found it go ahead pick them up add them to your inventory and make your way exactly where i am over here to this little car that spawns what you're gonna want to do is hop inside of this car and begin driving it exactly where i am and head all the way over to the shuri npc then you're gonna want to go up and talk to her and purchase her black panther claws this point Point, you should have both Shuri's claws as well as War Machine's hover jets in your backpack. Now all we need to do is wait for one of the Iron Man armories to spawn into the match. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, there it comes. There it comes. Obviously, now we're just going to hop in our vehicle and begin to make our way over there. Once you arrive, go ahead and make your way inside and accept the Iron Man loadout. Once you've done that, go ahead and pick up the Iron Man's flight kit because that's the only other mythic we need. And the rest is pretty easy. You remember a few weeks ago when Shuri's mythic was added into the game? That showcase for you guys is absolutely insane same glitch that would allow you to fly up to max height. Well, now that the Iron Man flight kit is in the game, we're able to use it for an even crazier glitch. First things first, we need to wait for the supercharge ability to become fully charged up. The rest is easy. We're going to activate the supercharge claws feature and then start pouncing into the air while immediately activating our hover jetpack. Just keep doing this the entire time while looking directly up. Then go ahead and activate the Iron Man flight kit and you will go even higher, ladies and gentlemen. Now, this isn't nearly as high as the flying glitch I showcased earlier this week, but that that one was a little more difficult as it required you to disconnect your internet at a certain point don't get it twisted this one is still insane and makes it easier than ever to quickly get to max height and don't worry coming up next we're going to unlock the free iron man emo but first ladies and gentlemen i'm sure i'll remember back in the original marvel season being chapter 2 season 4 one of the battle pass skins was a marvel character that goes by the name thor as we all know thor uses this weapon known as thor's hammer aka mjolnir it wasn't just a mythic ability we we're able to pick up and use but also a pickaxe release inside of the battle pass so interesting about this is Thor was literally the only character in Fortnite that was worthy of wielding this. Like, check this out. If we go ahead and equip Thor's hammer, then also equip some random skin, like let's go with Batman, you'll notice that the hammer literally just appears as the default pickaxe. It says that that's because it's not equipped with a worthy outfit. It's 100% accurate to the Marvel storyline, where no one was able to lift Thor's hammer except for him. Recently, Epic Games did a major, major change to the Thor hammer's pickaxe. A bunch of brand new characters in Fortnite are now worthy of wielding it. First one is the most obvious, being none other than Captain America, aka Steven Rogers. Which means now, for the first time ever, someone other than Thor is able to wield his hammer. There's actually a very, very interesting reason of why Captain America is worthy. I'm sure a bunch of you diehard Marvel fans already knew Captain America was worthy. We actually got to see him pick it up in Avengers Endgame, use it in their fight against Thanos. What's even more interesting is, you know, the brand new version of Captain America we received this season, known as Captain Jones. Unfortunately, him himself isn't worthy of lifting Thor's hammer. Obviously, that's because even though Captain Jones and Captain America are very, very similar, they're actually totally separate people, meaning Jones isn't worthy. But you haven't seen anything yet, because one of the brand new skins now worthy of wielding Mjolnir is actually none other than this character that goes by the name Moon Knight. The whole reason Moon Knight is worthy is super surprising, because inside of one of the Marvel comic books, Moon Knight was able to wield Mjolnir because it was literally made up out of moon rock. But did you know there's actually a cool glitch that'll let any skin use Thor's hammer? I'm gonna show you how to do it. First things first, go ahead and equip it, and then pick any any skin you want that isn't worthy. I'm gonna go with Agent Peely right here. And then, and this is very, very important,
important. Go ahead and load into the Day of Doom game mode. I do need to make sure you spawn on Dr. Doom's team as one of the henchmen. Then go ahead and drop into the game, land anywhere on the map. And for some reason, as you can see, Thor's hammer is equipped as the pickaxe still. And you're using it as one of Doom's henchmen. Now, I definitely don't think this is accurate to the Marvel storyline. This is likely just a glitch accidentally added by Epic Games. It is still super cool and unique to see other characters use Thor's hammer. Make sure you give this a go before Epic Games fixes it. That's what I'm messing around, ladies and gentlemen. It's time for the moment you've all been waiting for. Because the brand new update we received this week actually added a ton of free rewards everyone can unlock. These rewards are totally separate from the ones I showcased in the last video. You're able to unlock by surviving storm circles and earning badges, but instead some totally free brand new rewards. First things first, in the Epic Games launcher, just go ahead and search for the game Rocket League. If you don't have the Epic Games launcher and you're on PlayStation, Xbox, or Nintendo Switch, don't worry, you're still able to get this reward on those consoles. You just need to search for Rocket League the exact same way and go ahead and hit the install button to download it. Once the download's completed, all you need to do now is open up Rocket League, go ahead and log into your Epic Games account. And then once you're at the main menu, you're gonna wanna click on this thing that says Item Shop. And right here in the bottom right, you'll see the Ultra Star wheels that are totally free. Go ahead and click on them and then hit Claim Item in the top left. After that, the brand new Ultra Star Luxury Wheels will be yours for totally free. And then, the very next time you open up Fortnite and log back into your account, you'll have a bunch of awesome rewards waiting for you. One of them is this super awesome Admiral style for your cars. After that, we have a bunch of decals that honestly aren't that interesting. You'll also get some super awesome Nissan Fair Lady Z wheels, as well as the Nissan Fair Lady Z car. A bunch more boring decals. This vehicle, known as the BMW 1 Series, which is super cool. And finally, two more sets of wheels with one of them being the ultra star wheels that we just claimed from the item shop you haven't seen anything yet because we all know a few days ago brand new iron man mark 45 skin finally released boy oh boy was it awesome i think this is probably one of the more detailed skins we've ever gotten in fortnite however everyone was disappointed that this didn't come with an emo but there is one and everyone is able to unlock it for free as you can see we're currently dropping into a game getting ready to unlock it first things first as soon as you jump out of the battle bus you're gonna want to make your way towards the other windmill landmark because here it's obviously Obviously the location of the brand new Iron Man Mark 45 NPC. Oh boys, we got some enemies landing here. Give me one second. Let me run over to the star chest and get a weapon. Ooh, we got the Iron Man Mythic boots. That's what I'm talking about. Oh dear, they're rushing me. Got one. Oh, here he is. Here he is. Here he is. Here he is. Yes, thanks for playing, Rabbit Kicks. Anyways, from this point, all you're gonna wanna do is go up and interact with the Iron Man NPC. Then, go ahead and purchase Iron Man's combat kit for 600 gold. Technically, you don't need to spend 600 gold to get it from Iron Man. Because if you get super lucky and end up getting it from one of the Stark chests, that's okay, that'll work as well. You're just gonna wanna make sure you acquire the Iron Man flight kit, no matter how you accomplish that. Unfortunately, from here, we need to wait a little bit longer for the second part of this to become active. So in the meantime, we have another free emote you can unlock. All you need to do is go to this exact website, fortnite.com slash redeem. Then, in this little box that says enter access code, you're gonna wanna type this exact code that you see on your screen right now, and go ahead and hit the redeem button. Then it'll take you to this screen, where it says the code is for a brand new Diabolica emoticon. And after that, all you need to do is hit the activate button, and then this unique emoticon will instantly be yours for totally free. The downside is, the code is a limited amount of uses, so make sure you enter it and redeem it as quick as possible. Back to unlocking the free emote. Now, each and every single week, we receive some brand new store request for us to complete. Well, check this out. Recently, Epic Games pushed out and published the brand new quest rewards. And these rewards essentially unlock as you progress through the weekly storyline quest. One of these rewards is actually the super interesting Peel Vereen spray. What's so interesting is Epic Games didn't actually mean to release this spray at all. And instead, they actually meant for it to be an emote, like you're able to see the spray is labeled. This means everyone and anyone that unlocked this emote over the next upcoming week will actually receive a free emote when Epic Games fixes it in the very next update. And we don't have any word if this emote is actually gonna be related to the brand new Iron Man skin. And instead, it'll likely have something to do with Wolverine and Peelverine, since obviously that's what the spray, aka its placeholder, was related to. Either way, a free emote for everyone is super awesome, and you won't hear me complaining. Oh, some of the final enemies by the unit again shall we yes finally we're just getting started though boys dive bomb got him ready for this dude Whoa. oh one shot uh oh uh oh boys big gun fight right there I see you bud got him this guy oh my goodness oh and the last player died to the storm that's what i'm talking about as soon as the free emote is available for everybody to unlock i'll make sure to let all of you guys know by making a tweet over my official twitter account at home at games yt thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed have an absolutely incredible rest of your day i'll see you guys in the next video peace out